Okay, so it's again time for a new video and today we have the Akai MPC2000 and what we want to illustrate is this floppy emulator which we have installed into this Groovebox MIDI production center. Good, let's turn it on. So, so you can see here, it looks for some hard drives. But it also starts booting up the boot disk. So just for short explanation, the MPC2000 needs a boot disk. The 2000XL does not need a boot disk. We can see it. Great. Okay, so um, we have now booted up our device and we want to change the disk to a sound disk and try out some sound. So I will then change it here. You can see demo tree it says. Okay, so this part is a bit complicated because uh, one hand is holding the phone here to record. So you do like this and disk. And you can then see it already looks what is on the, uh, the virtual disk. So there is the bass drum. So what we do is we then say, do it. And now what we can do is we can first listen to the sound. Sounds okay. So we want to assign it to pad one. Yeah, so we can see the assigned pad and the mistake key. Blop. Uh, we can then change the sound. What is the score here? Again, same concept. Uh, let's say pad three, pad three. Let's hear it. Okay, keep. Uh, snare. Again, pad two. That's okay. You can hear it. And keep. Okay, um, let's keep this simple. So we go back to the main menu. We change the tempo to. 90. Okay, can I take another tempo? But let's just take 90 for this testing purpose. And say here. So let's say we like this and uh, let me just stop. So what would we do now? So now you would then go to your floppy emulator and then you would switch to a blank disk like here. And then you would say, okay, shift and disk. And then you will change it to save so we can see here um we only have 274 kilobyte left on this disk but that's because i was working on something else but that's okay so we just click do it this is save all and as it's safe you can then hear that make a sound here and we can see that it writes to the to the thing that's it. Now what we just generated is saved onto the disk. And then you can basically load it up as you saw with the uh, demo disk before. And that's basically it. That's just what I want to show. So again, thank you for watching. This is the Akai MPC2000 installed with a, a USB floppy emulator. Thank you.